It is 11.06 a.m. May 6, 2021. And we're back in 2D mode because we gotta do stuff. Not talk to you. Stop it. Bum, bum, bum. Doing an earlier stream today because I wanted to. So shut up. Don't make me kick your ass. I'll do it too. I don't give a fuck. Okay. So we unlocked a new thingamajigger. So let's head there. Um, must be over here. Altar of the Chosen. Du, 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 du. Rose's room. Let's go to Rose's room. I don't know why. Let's just do that and that's how it goes. Okay. If you stay in the thieving game long enough, you start to get a sense for the valuable stuff. It's like you start to tingle when there's something worth stealing nearby. Hey, don't look at me like that. Not like I'm gonna take anything. I'm just making conversation, that's all. <laughs> it's not the most spacious room I've ever seen, but I love what they've done with the upholstery. It's fit for a princess. Uh-huh. Hmm, I'm not sure I like this room. Isn't there something gloomy about all these stone walls? I can't imagine it would be a lot of fun to spend time here alone. The ceiling is rather low for my liking. I must remain vigilant lest I hit my head. My, my. Can you see these walls glowing, laddie? It looks like they're built from a very unusual type of stone. Okay. I guess. I mean, if you truly think about it for about five seconds. For about five freaking seconds. Yay, we're in. Uh, okay. I have no idea what's going on here. What? Sir Rose Guardian, stop it, please. Help us, please. Must destroy... Clank. Must destroy everything. Okay. Sir, Sir Rose Garden. So we're in a battle right off the bat. That's a fun time. Is it not? Da -na -na -na. Bum, bum, bum. Unbridled blade. I don't know how tough this dude is, but... I suppose we shall find out. Can open our Oh Starting off with the damage, are we? I see how it is. Oh yeah. I don't think poison works, but he's dead anyway, so that <laughs> doesn't really matter. 7113 experience point, 3044 gold coin is uh Okay. So did 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 we win? I don't believe it. The fluid of revelation has been destroyed. Does this mean I won't be able to see sorrow anymore? Oh, I remember sorrow. <laughs> Why would anyone do such a thing? Who would be cruel enough to possess Sir Rose Garden and let and set him on us like this? Huh? Thank you very much for rescuing us. You're a goo person. You mustn't blame Sir Rose Garden for attacking us, though. He's not some horrible monster. He's been Rose's staunchest defender since Slime Immemorial. I don't know what happened to him, but he just changed completely all of a sudden. He started attacking us like he was possessed or something. It was so surprising. 
The next thing we knew, he'd smashed up Rose's beloved flute of revelation. Now it's completely oozeless. It's it's what her boyfriend Sorrow oozes to get into this room. Without it, they won't be able to see each other. It's a tragedy, don't you think? Rose and Sorrow are so great together. That's why I've decided to make a new flute of revelation and give it to Rose as a present. Hey, I don't slurp clothes you'd be able to help, would you? No. Huh? The slime in Rose's room wants you to help look for materials to make a new flute of revelation. I guess the slime has no name. It's just the slime in Rose's room. Sure, why not? Really? That's great! Now, what I need you to do is bring me the wood I'll be oozing. My goo grandmother once told me that you can't ooze just any old wood to make something like the Flute of Revelation. You need some timber from a very special tree indeed. It's called the Revel Tree, and it grows in the forest where the fairies live. Oh, we can actually go there, I believe. Could you go and fetch some for me? Once you brought me it, I'll be able to make the flute no slime. Oh, and don't worry about Rose and Sir Rose Garden. I'm gooing to stick to them like goo and make sure nothing else bad happens. Fun. Oh, Rosie, revelation. So I know where that forest is. How you doing? Uh, er, I seem to be back to my <coughs> old self. You have my thanks, kind sir. Alas, I have very little recollection of what happened to me. I do recall voices in my <coughs> head urging me to destroy everything, but that is all. Still, whether it was my own volition or not is beside the point. I had a duty to protect Rose, and instead I turned my <coughs> sword upon her. What is more, I have destroyed the precious flute of Revelation, the only <coughs> means by which she and Sorrow could be reunited. I have thoroughly disgraced myself. I must gather my meager <coughs> possessions and leave the tower immediately. Okay, have fun with that. So, now we want to go to, uh, b -b -b the Everglade? Is that what it's called? Is that what I'm thinking of? I'm not sure. Maybe. The, the, the Neverglade, whatever it's called. Was that the forest? I don't remember. I think so, but I could be wrong. Nope, this is it. Ha, ha, ha. Now we gotta find a tree, apparently. Oh, hey, you're looking for a magical tree that grows in the forest where the fairies live. Hmm, I'm not sure about the tree itself, but I know where you'll find a branch from it. There's a local Sylvopithecus that uses it to practice its fencing skills. I suppose you'll have to fight it to get the thing off it, though. Or, good luck. And where is that? Just some random place? Not in here, but... Yeah. So we just gotta fight a silver pathless, or... Maybe we gotta find an actual tree? I don't know. I don't know. Do, 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 do. Just bring it back here, you little packer. I can say, are there no encounters here? Hellbound horrors. That's exciting. Not what I meant to do, sir. Giga smash. Well, okay then. Yeah, 
worth all that took. So maybe you just gotta get into a random encounter with one. Oh, well, there's one. <laughs> Fails to steal anything, of course. You've acquired a Rebel Tree branch. Go and give it to the Slime and Roses room. Well, that was fun. <laughs> it's as simple as that. Now we just gotta get out of here. Somehow, somewhere. Metal Slime Knight. In case you weren't aware. get back, but... There we go. Okay. Back to Rose's room. Maybe she has something to say about Dorothy. Rose's room! So I got your little thingamajigger. Rebel tree brands, the bow of a tree that towers over the Neverglade, brimming with magical might. Is that right? And yes, I meant for that to rhyme. Good day to you. Did you get the special wood I need to ooze for the flute? There you go. Oh, this is great! I can feel the magic just oozing out of it. Thanks so much. I'm going to start working on the new Flute of Revelation right away. I can't wait to show Rose and Sir Rose Garden. Oh, and here's a little something for your trouble. You got us out of a sticky situation there. You get a Tempest Shield, which may or may not be good. I don't know. Victorious! Rose and Sir Rose Garden were absolutely delighted when I surprised them with the new Flute of Revelation. Thank you so much for all your help. You really are a goo person. Come back and say hello next time you're in the area. Thank you so much. Now I'll be able to meet my beloved Sorrow once again. The th thought of seeing his face, gosh, it, it made me all... It's made me all... <laughs> Emotional. Ruby tears start to roll down Rose's cheeks. You catch them as they fall. Why would I catch them? But as soon as they touch your hand, the, the jewels shatter. Okay? What's the point of that? <laughs> what? Excuse me? An all-new flute of revelation. I can scarcely ca believe it. Thank you, good sir, for all you have done. The burden of guilt which weighed heavy on my heart has been lifted. I hereby vow, with renewed uh, vigor, to do my utmost to protect Rose from those who seek to harm her. Okay. So I imagine that tear thing has something to do with something. We just can't do anything with it yet. I mean, I would imagine. Okay, that was a fun little trip. That's all we can do for now. There's one, there's one side quest we, there's one quest we still need to finish, but we need some kind of book for that. No idea where it could be, but. Unless. And maybe we can find another book at, uh, where, where we found that other book. 
it's possible. We'll take a quick look, just to be sure. No books of interest. No books of interest. Although it's very possible we could find it in, you know, 3D mode somewhere. In fact, that wouldn't surprise me at all. Okay, well, maybe it's in here, but we can't open that. I don't know. I don't know, man. So let's move on for now. I wonder if we ever get to go in there. Maybe, maybe after you complete all the like quests here or whatever. Then, then, then maybe you go in there for something. I don't know. But I imagine it's something like that. So we got a new shield. That's that could be nice. I mean, it could be. Doesn't mean it will be. Dun, dun, dun. Is it better than the ethereal shield too? Oh, we got the shield of Heliodor. I, I didn't even notice that. You have it. I don't know why you have it, but... Shield of Heliodor. Actually looks good for the armor, but... Um, you know, it's not as good stat-wise. But it looks great with the armor and the axe, because they all kind of go together. Not technically, but... Like, look-wise. Wait, why is the Tempest Shield in your inventory? Because of 2D mode, I guess. I don't freaking know. see what it looks like. A breeze-proof buckler that can send enemies soaring off to who knows where. Stat-wise, it's not that great. Wind damage taken reduced by 15%. Target all enemies and makes them disappear when used as an item in battle. So it casts poof, I guess. <laughs> Look at that thing. Dun 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 I'm gonna put that on just because it looks better. <laughs> the highest honor of King Carnelian's realm, presented only to the most noble and accomplished of its knights. Just gonna put that on you because it looks better. <laughs> you know, because I'm a vain person and such. 50 quests out of 76. Very nice. Eh, there's still some we need to do. We can do that one once we can get to the Hotto area. And that one, when, when we can get, the go get to the Galopolis. I don't know if we can actually get there or not right now. Maybe, but I'm not sure. Dun, 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 dun. I think we can do that one now. Um. Desert Island in the far west. I think that's in Galopolis. But I'm not sure. That's what we need that book for. Okay. So let's go to Lanolulu real quick. Go ahead and crank this out. 
because I believe we want to uh, talk to that woman with the cannon, if you remember, who lent us that cannon when we went to fought the Tentacular originally. I'm going to crank this one out. Wave weed. Everybody likes wave weed. Except for Bongo. Do 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 do. Snag some items along the way as always. You know how we do. Ripple drops. We go with the ripple drops, man. I don't remember exactly who, like, this quest is for specifically. I don't even, I don't really recall, but that's not where we're going. I think it was someone in Nautica, but I don't remember exactly. But, oh well, we'll figure it out. Yeah, we, we got all the loot here. Nothing to worry about. Wait, was there any sparkly spots up here? Yeah, there is. Okay, cool. Love me sparkly spots. Dunk of thinking sense. Nothing wrong with that. Oh, she's not up here. Meh. Um, I think she's in one, one of the homes, like, right below here, so... Yeah, I think she's only up here at night. So, that's how that goes. Is it this building over here? Well, there's cannons all over, so I would say yes. Cannon lady's house. Aloha, friend. Long time no see. What can I do for you? You explained that the curator of a certain museum wants to exhibit an enormous explosive sleek black squid-like object, and one of the cannon ladies' cannons might just fill the bill. Oh yeah, yeah, it's the uh, turtle dude. That's right. He Ake Nano? Where do you get off calling my beautiful baby squids? I'll put you over my knee, mister. I would like to see you try. Still, if this curator guy likes my late husband's cannons enough to want to put one on a pedestal, he must have his head screwed on, right? Sure, friend, you got it. I'll let you borrow the biggest, shiniest, most ear-splitting cannon in my collection. We get a Kanono cannon. Do, 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 do. You convinced the cannon lady to lend you the Kanono cannon. You should head back to the Royal Nautican Terrarium and give it to the curator. I guess I could do that. Oh, Zoom takes zero MP? I thought it took MP to use. I guess not. That's pretty sweet, actually. I like that. It's nice. Bum, bum, bum. So, can you actually, like, leave here as a fish? Because I think you actually have to in order to get that, uh... Get, uh, get a certain something. Get that treasure from the ship or whatever it was. I think. I could be wrong about that, but... Can we not, uh... Oh, we gotta turn into a fish, I think. Unless you can jump up there. No, I don't think you can do that. We gotta turn into a fish to get back up there. You know, because we don't know how to swim. We may be able to breathe underwater, but we don't know how to swim. Because we, uh... We decided to slack off during swim lessons. So... Alright, blue fishy time. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. Da na 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 na. Alright. To the terrarium. Go ahead down here and grab this again. I don't remember what it is, but... Hey, it's a free item, so... Really doesn't matter what it is. It's free! Blue eye, okay. 
I'll take that. Is there one in this thing too? I don't remember. Yes, there is. Nice. We'll take whatever that is. Red eye. Okay. <laughs> getting, getting all the eyes. That's what we're doing. We're dotting the I's and crossing the T's and such. How you doing, mi mi Mr. Sleepy Toidle? Oh, what are you carrying, Luminary? Is it an enormous, explosive, sleek, black, squid-like object that's big enough to swallow a mermaid? Yes, it is, I guess. Yes, this is it. This is the very sleek, black, squid-like item I have been looking for. What's that, you say? It is actually a type of weapon. And it makes a loud noise when it fires a metal ball into the air. Ho, ho, ho. You humans will fight with anything, even sleek black squids. <laughs> I always knew that you were a warlike species, but this is a revelation. The study of human society is endlessly fascinating. Thank you, Luminary. This is the perfect exhibit with which to honor, hmm, the 600th anniversary of the museum's founding. That's a long time. Please allow me to give you this in return, yes? From all of us here at the Royal Terrarium. You get a recipe book entitled Secrets of the Sunken Spirit. Learn how to make fathom forks. Okay. To success, this quest has been transgressed with finesse. Bonk. Good stuff. That's another one down. I guess you can't use it when you're a fish, huh? Is that just the way it is? Yes, it is. Okay. Alright, so... I think that's all of them we can do for now, I think. 51 out of 76. Um, let me see here. And yeah, we gotta go to Cryptic Crypt for that. We gotta go to Gondolia for that. Or, wait, what? Wait, what? What the fuck? Oh, Galapagos, yeah. I'm not sure if we can actually get there, and I don't think so, but... Desert Island in the Far West. I'm guessing that's Galapagos, but I'm not 100% sure. Oh, right, the thing I was thinking of was the Sage of Stone. I thought it was somewhere else, but it was actually, yeah, it was, you know... It, it was here. Never mind, I don't know. We already did that. We don't need to worry about that bullshit. Okay. So, before we head to the Golden Castle, where we're supposed to be going, we're gonna go to stop off at Octagon here real quick and, uh, you know, see see if we can't get, get a jackpot going. 